Okay, time for bed. Good night, man, who's been at my window for the past week. But first, time for my routine breath check before I go to bed. <laughs> I smell pretty bad. I should probably go brush my teeth because last time I went to the dentist, they asked if I had gold teeth. I took it as a compliment because maybe I was dripping that day, looking real rich, but no. They said I was filthy and I ain't talking about filthy rich. But maybe I shouldn't because after all, I am alone. All the other poker bears took out the poker mobile for the day without me. You know what? Maybe it'll start liking me more if I brush my teeth. Let's go, Potter. <laughs> I can finally play that teeth brushing song since I'm all alone. Why do we do the shmurdle, Billy? Yes, we should do the shmurdle. And no, this isn't the about a week ago one. And then we grab a grown up to help. Uh, a, a grown up? I, I, I can't. There's no, there's nobody around to help. I'm gonna have to go to bed, stinky. I guess. I mean, there's no other toothpaste brands in here. Can you? You? Who the fuck put the ingredients for a lasagna in the bathroom? You don't think it was the aliens from Chicken Little? Let's take a look. Hello, Poker Bear. It is me, creator of the universe, and technically the name of my favorite sitcom, God. I have opened the gates of heaven, or should I say the cold gates, to bring you this product in your time of need. Oh wow, I'm so flattered, but God, I have a lot of questions. I have the answer to everything, my dear boy. Why did you appear in the WWE with Vince McMahon that one time? They had a live sex celebration before marriage, and I'm sure you don't approve of that. Well, I do not. But God forgives all in their time of need. Just like how at that time, God needed a whole lot of money. My son has been crucified countless times, and my pharmacy bill for painkillers is way too high. Okay, and secondly, why the lasagna? Well, that, my child, is a question which answer can only be found inside of you. Now, God must go and star in another episode of Family Guy. Hmm, well I guess you never really know what's going to happen when you wake up, huh? The only thing that could top seeing God right now is seeing my favourite YouTuber. Well, let's get this show on the road. Enough grating, time for the taste test. Oh, uh, welcome ladies and gentlemen and children of all ages to another episode of Poker Bear's Kit. Sorry, uh, I'm still getting used to this, you know, uh, Poker Bear's Bathroom. You know, this is all very sudden, I, I, I wasn't planning on this, but... It, we, we improv, we adjust, you know? But thank you, live studio audience, for being here on such short notice. I didn't even know how 60 of you managed to fit in the shower, but try not to slip. Okay, so today we will be making a lasagna from scratch and in the sink. We have all of our ingredients here, but we are missing one thing, and that is the oven. But I'm sure if we left the sink on long enough, the water will be hot enough to cook our food. So that is what we're going to do. So first, add in your meat, and then add in your sauce, and then the sheets. And now we wait. Oh man, I feel so dumb. Down. It's time to get down. Get down on my knees and pray. Think about what God said, Polly. Well, that, my child, is a question which answer can only be found inside of you. Inside of me? Maybe that's why the lasagna isn't cooking. Not because it's being done in a sink or anything, but this is my destiny. Of course, he left the lasagna in the bathroom when I needed to brush my teeth. So that is what I need to do. Mm -hmm. Scrub, 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 scrub. And boy, look at those pearly whites. This has been one epic journey. Live studio wallet. Audit, 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 audit. Sorry, I, I got a little bit of mint stuck in my, my, my teeth. Anyone get a toothpick? Yeah. Oh, you do? Thank you, I, I, I'll take that. Did I just pick my tooth out? After I brushed my teeth with lasagna, I went on to the interwebs and researched if any of my fellow Redditors had done the same. All I needed to look up were two buzzwords, toothpaste lasagna, and it was then that I found something truly, truly horrible in the deepest, darkest catacombs of the Googles. Colgate made their own brand of lasagna. I'm pretty sure they were trying some weird BuzzFeed analytical quiz technology to make our brains associate Colgate with cold things, which is why the meals are frozen. There's little to no proof of this ever being an actual thing. Apart from a couple of magazine articles which quotes were quickly redacted, but this lasagna ended up being in a museum of failures, and Colgate wanted to put a gate in that one and lock it up. The company's legal representative contacted the museum after they showcased it and stated, <coughs> well, the, the, the cost's not actually in the quote. Colgate has no recollection of Colgate lasagna, and if I know anything about a court of law, and believe me, I do, then this is fluffy legal language, where Colgate are neither confirming or denying the existence of Colgate lasagna, in case 
guess someone sues them in the future when it's proved to be true. But that's some smart shit, man. As someone who's made several appearances in the Jeremy Kyle show for BBMing kids my mini cereal box cock, when I eventually ended up in court, my lawyer told me to repeatedly plead the fifth, but I ended up accidentally pleading guilty to incriminating five-year-old children. But Colgate lasagna was going to be the next big thing. I even heard Bill Gates was going to invest in it. It seemed like a real passion project, and since they're denying it even though it's real, my poker bear sense is picking up on it. This is my 10th channel why food theory, that they are actually hiding tiny increments of lasagna in every tube of toothpaste, and there's only one guy I know who's an expert at hiding items from people. Hello everybody, I, it's me Walter White standing in for Poker Bear, but one person who's not standing is my son because I just sly tackled him. My other son also has brain damage because I've gradually been putting more and more Calpo on a spoon. And right now, we're at the only a spoonful stage, but yes, I did some experiments in the lab and I found out that there are tiny traces of glycerin, aka animal fat, inside of toothpaste. Bitch. That, that's not my bit. Yeah, see, I... I'm sorry. Just, just forget about it. Aww. So yes, there is tiny bits of animal fat and toothpaste, and every component of the lasagna can come from uppercutting cows, but if you want to be more environmentally friendly, eat corn, but just know the green giant ain't going to be too happy about it. But please take a look at this packaging for this Colgate product. The colours, what do they mean? Blue, white and red. Now think about what we have learned today, lasagna. The red obviously represents the tomato sauce which covers the mince, the white represents the sauce lathering the sheet, and the blue, blue cheese. When this shit is made at the factory, it's actually yellow, but by the time it hits stores, it turns blue because it's gone sour, but there's only one way to test if any of this is true, a taste test. Hello there ladies and gentlemen, it's me live action Poker Bear. You may remember me from the live action Scooby Doo movies or Surf's Up Wave Mania. And today we're here to taste test some of these goodies. Toothpaste and toothpaste. Uh, we're going to do this one take, you know like that film 1917. So let's go. Okay, this is the lasagna I freshly prepared in my bathroom. It looks... Oh, my lips are watering. Mm. Oh, yeah, just look at that. Oh, oh, yeah, get that in my hands, baby. Okay. Uh, <coughs> yeah. That... Uh, do you hear that crunch? That's me brushing my teeth. That, that, that sure is nice. Right. <laughs> I am an enemy of the state. I'm <coughs> I have lung cancer. Um, my, my wife and kid don't know yet. I, I, and I started doing med. Today for a second option, we're also going to have lasagna. Okay, toothpaste. Alright, first of pressures, that tastes a lot like fucking lasagna. Hmm. I never really thought about it like this until now, but... Holy shit, that is... Am I is that lasagna? Let me check. No, that's two. There's no way that's not lasagna. Okay, so myth busted. Lasagna is toothpaste. <laughs> So in conclusion, alright guys, don't do what I did. I am one stupid cunt. So do you know how they told you that two pluses make a plus in math class? I well, don't listen to them. My teeth are fucking falling out. They started fucking talking to me after I recorded saying, Hey man, we gotta leave now. We too fresh for your whack ass. And then they really did just get up out of here. Some people say that knowledge is key. And technically they're right because my teeth have just unlocked. The last time I went to the dentist, they told me that to have healthy teeth, I have to floss. So here goes. I've I be fussing. I be fussing. I be fussing. I be fussing.